plenty of red shirts forward. Oh, what a special goal! He's so fast and so quick on the ball, and his little tricks would make everyone go, oh, every time. And it comes for Ronaldo! How about that for style? He drove teams absolutely crazy. They were scared of him. They were absolutely scared of him. He's threatened every time he's had the ball. And he finds the net with a brilliant shot. His free kicks were fantastic. How he could get the ball up and down so quickly and with such pace on it, to me it was phenomenal. Magnificent! Is there any end to this boy's talents? When David Beckham left Old Trafford in the summer of 2003, a new hero was needed to fill the iconic number seven shirt. The player United turned to was a little known 18 year old from Portugal. But Cristiano Ronaldo was about to make a name for himself. We've got this young kid from Portugal that no one had ever heard of. And the Beckhams and Cantonars and Robsons who wore that shirt before him. The skills were sublime, really. You know, stepping over the ball and just doing things that fans like to see. You know, trying things that, you know, you probably would only ever try on a, on a training pitch, usually. I felt that there was something new happened that day when he came on. There was a, like, a aura went round the ground when they saw the dazzling feet, the silver boots, and I said, I turned to Gene that day and I said, I think we have found a star here. He was far off the finished article when he arrived, um, you know, and he, he learned so much. He became a more complete and all-round player. I think he went to the gym quite a bit, which, you know, he added to the, to the goal celebration for, for us ladies, I think. <laughs> I think to really succeed, you need a little bit of arrogance. In such a... Um, a great team like United, you need that arrogance, you need that confidence. He was named Player and Young Player of the Year as United won the title in 2006-07. But he really hit his peak the following season when he collected an astonishing 42 goals on the way to becoming European and Premier League champions. He was a massive influence to the team. Everyone looked for Ronaldo every time he played. Defenders were petrified of him. People didn't want to play up against him. You're already one little ahead when you've got Ronaldo playing on your team. Really. On the way, all the way. That's just what they needed. A goal inside three minutes. He was immense. On what an array of free kicks. When he got on the ball, you knew something was going to happen and you got excited and there was a hush in the ground and then an anticipation of what was going to come. And nine times out of ten, something happened. He smashed it into the back of the net. It gets even better for Cristiano Ronaldo. Never knew where it was going to go, which even scientifically they, they tried to look into to find out where he hit the ball, what kind of ball it was that made it do that. It's Ronaldo and it's absolutely top draw. He rounded off his season in style, scoring United's goal in the Champions League final. And later he was crowned World and European Footballer of the Year. The next season would be his last at Old Trafford, but he bowed out in real style. It's Cristiano Ronaldo, he has got the goal! And he's done it! A century of Manchester United goals for Cristiano Ronaldo! You can only thank Sir Alex again for giving us as United fans the opportunity to, to witness and enjoy a player of his ability. And I hope one day that he'll be able to come and grace the Old Trafford turf in the United shirt again because the rush that he gave, there was nothing like it.